Many of you guys in the comments have been asking about more MMA content, and now we have it courtesy of Bleacher Report's John Hyannis, a fantastic writer on there. Take it away, John. I'm John Hyannis with the Young Turk Sports Show, bringing you the latest in MMA coverage. On Saturday, the UFC will bring its action over to Montreal, Quebec, Canada for UFC 158, where they'll have one of the most anticipated title fights in recent memory. Welterweight champion Georgia St. Pierre defends his belt against former Strike Force champ Nick Diaz. This booking was controversial from the beginning because Diaz actually lost his most recent fight at UFC 143 back in February of last year against Carlos Condit for the interim welterweight title while St. Pierre was healing a knee injury. Despite that fact, due to all the bad blood between Diaz and St. Pierre, this fight is still going down. Diaz has done everything he can to get in St. Pierre's head over the past week as they hype up the fight, saying that he's used steroids and that he's been lived a pampered lifestyle ever since he's made it big as a fighter. Nevertheless, whether or not Diaz actually has or hasn't gotten in St. Pierre's head, I can't see the champ losing this fight. Nick Diaz is a good fighter, solid boxing, insane cardio, and excellent jiu-jitsu, a Caesar Gracie black belted Brazilian jiu-jitsu as a matter of fact, but St. Pierre is just on a whole nother level than any other welterweight in the game today. His power, his speed, his explosive takedowns, and he's a black belt as well under Hedzo Gracie. So, I mean, whatever Diaz could throw at him, I think he's going to be able to counter. Diaz is going to be difficult to hold down, but I think St. Pierre, again, he's just the total package. His wrestling and his strength is really going to be the difference maker with this fight. Diaz may be able to give him a couple scares on the ground with his submission skills, but it's been a long time since anyone put St. Pierre in trouble on the mat, and I don't think this is going to be any different. Georgia St. Pierre via unanimous decision. You can check out my articles at Bleacher Report in the UFC section or in the MMA section as I am a featured columnist for MMA. Additionally, I'm an MMA editor for eDraft. That's eDraft.com. And you can follow me on Twitter at Johnny Hardbody. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you soon.